Well, me and my friends are going to go up to Donad Fort. Here it is. Uh, don't think it's a frightfully long walk, but we'll have a look. Well, this is uh, the first bit of the climb up to Donad Fort. Steep climb the rocky path, discover the ruined ramparts, viewed across Argyle. Well, it said it was a steep path, and it is. I don't know how much further we've got to go, but we're going to make it today. The kings of Dalriata ruled that kingdom from Donad. Their descendants became the first kings of Scotland, and their people, called the Scotti, became the first Scots. The language of the Gaels came to dominate much of Scotland. Gaelic is still spoken today. Donad fell to the powerful Pictish warlord Agnes in 736 AD. Some scholars believe it may never have regained its independence. The inauguration stone has been protected beneath a concrete replica since the 1970s. And there's the delicate carvings on the stone. Looks like that's the stone there, to be honest with you. It's got a sort of footstep in the top. What do you say about that? In legend, the hero Ossian leapt here from Ruda Hill, a kilometre away. His foot gouged out, gouged out the footprint. His knee the basin, and his outstretched sides, outstretched hands left finger marks. Well, there you are. We're nearly at the top. Well, we made it to the top. That's Jura up there. That's absolutely certain. It's quite windy up here. That's the hardest bit of climbing I've done for years. It's quite steep. But the dogs enjoyed it. There, if you can see in the bottom, the dark coloured car is mine. Anyway, that's done ad.